Welcome in Libras. Welcome to Ocean Tarot Garden, Garden Babes. Thank you for tuning in to all my cross watchers and Libras. All right, so we're going to see what message is here for you guys today. First, I'm going to pull a couple of cards and see what the Ascended Masters have to issue you, what warrant they have to issue you, okay? I just want to let you, I just want to say this, y'all, make sure you are cleansing your crystals, okay? I feel like it's very important. They're holding a lot of energy right now. It's time for you to, to um, cleanse your crystals, okay? Um, we also have peace, peace offering and trust, health and healing, okay? So I do feel like a lot of you guys, mm, like I said, cleanse your crystals, but also feel like it's cleansing your body as well. Um... Look, some of you guys could be feeling like some kind of issues with the stomach area or something like that, or just feeling like some kind of muscle spasms. But I really feel like it's it's like the stomach area, I want to say muscle spasms, and maybe like in the head and the crown area, it's time for you to realign yourself. It's time for you to start taking a healthier approach, okay, in life. Healing is not just spiritually. Um, you need to do some things physically to also uh, to help with the spiritual aspect, okay? Your stomach is your intuition you cannot allow anything in your gut also think about fasting um detoxing exercising going out into nature um and just finding peace and realignment okay so also that it's also here and trust the process okay there's some positive changes that are about to come about for my libras yes so health seems to be very important so take heed to that okay to clear the minds of toxins. All right, so tell me what's going on with. Look at that. Speaking of the mind, we got dreams and then we got the brain card here. Focusing on yourself. Okay. All right, tell me about Libras. What does the Libras need to know? I got time today. Yeah, yeah. We all forgot the night. Black lights. Y'all, that song has been stuck in my fucking head. Whoever, because I don't have TikTok, so I'll be on Instagram, but I be seeing y'all TikTok videos on Instagram. So whoever did that little wetter twister remix was in their bag when they mixed it with the Beyonce cuff it up. I'm just gonna say that you was in your motherfucking bag, okay? Is in your bag. Look, Libras, you guys are getting a motherfucking warning. This is your final warning. We're calling Libras to the front. This is your final warning, Libras to the front. Okay, why the fuck they gotta embarrass y'all like that? Because I feel like spirit is on the fucking loudspeaker calling you guys to the motherfucking front. Like, Libra, why the fuck y'all guys can't listen? Why is your attention span so fucking short? Like, why do you say you're going to do something, then your ass be right back you turning? Get the fuck, okay? Like, get the fuck. Focus, people, focus. Okay? You so indecisive, you allowing people to come in and fucking make the decisions for you, okay? Don't let nobody guilt trip you. I got a song for that. Don't let nobody fucking play you, Okay? <laughs> All right, so we got the visiting your dreams, the focus on yourself, and the I need space. This is your final warning, okay? This is what Spirit's saying. This is your final warning right here because when they come to you in your dreams, it's like, bitch, you're not seeing these signs out here while you woke. You're not listening to your intuition. So I'm coming to you in a dream because you're going to look at this dream and be like, what the fuck, okay? So the dream, Pay attention to the messages in your dream because you're not paying attention to the signs, the colors, and all the other good stuff that keeps coming. You ever realize that when you start getting back into some bad habits, how you keep seeing the same numbers over and over again, but you don't look. You, so you be seeing 44, you like, oh, my angels protect me. No, bitch. We trying to tell you this your motherfucking final warning, okay, because look. We try to protect you from this. This is this is a continued cycle. Wake the fuck up type shit. Okay? Then you got to focus on yourself. Look, I need space. 
Didn't I tell you that y'all need to be getting realigned, regrounded and stuff? Don't let nobody take you off your game. You need to be just trying to be by yourself. A lot of you guys can be feeling like you want to be by yourself. You have a next level commitment here. Somebody might be wanting to have a relationship with you guys, but you guys are solely focused. Know that you need to be solely focused on you right now and growing you and all this other things and working on some other things here. This next level commitment could be to yourself, okay? You're committed to yourself and bettering yourself and giving yourself what you deserve, energy, self-love, all that great stuff, even when it comes to picking the people that you want in your life. However, some of you guys can be backtracking on that, so this is the final warning. We have separate time to go separate ways, a crossroad, and you're controlling. Somebody is over here trying to control your destiny, okay? I told you, you are so indecisive, even though that you know what you want, you're letting people make the decisions for you. It's time to stop it. Let's tap into the cards. All right, so tell me more about this visiting the dream for Libra. Tell me more about visiting the dreams for Libra. We didn't have that tonight. Black lights. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. Like, what? Why are we shuffling, y'all? Why don't y'all comment me a song blend on TikTok that you just, like, you can't stop singing? Like, what is a TikTok mix song that y'all just cannot stop singing? Okay? Because I'm just like, damn. Like, they be in their bag when they be mixing these songs up. They be in their fucking bag. Eight of Cups. Mm. Alright. Eight of Cups. All right, Libra, if you've been waking up kind of tired, just know that you are exploring different realms. You're going into different realms and seeing the different realities, okay? That you're exploring different realities, okay? So some of you guys could be dream travelers, um, okay? Uh, just moving from realm to realm, and you could be wondering why you're feeling so drained, okay? Also, it's like your dreams are telling you to explore something different, Okay? Okay, so it's like pay attention to your dreams. They're trying to guide you. They're trying to, I want to say like monitor you. They're trying to give you some kind of guidance and leadership and mentor you. Okay, this is how your spirits are speaking to you. Okay, they're trying to bring you into some enlightenment. Okay, you're being led. You're being um, guided. I feel like they're teaching you about different scenarios. In life as well. That's why you keep jumping from realm to realm. I feel like somebody is searching for some kind of uh, with the hair fit. Like some somebody's searching for some kind of leadership, or you're looking for some kind of answers, and those answers are coming in your dreams as well, Libra. Mm -hmm. They're gonna be very, very fluid. Your dreams are gonna be very fluid. So pay attention to those. Very, very fluid with this Queen of Cups. All right, so tell me more about the focus on yourself for Libra. Focus on yourself for Libra. I don't know why. Uh, yeah, Spirit just told me to tell you guys to be slow to anger. Yes, I'm slurping my tea. Told you to be slow to anger. We do have the seven of cups here with this three of wands here. Um, with the focus on yourself. I feel like you need to put your energy towards one thing and go towards it. Some of you guys might be trying to do too much, okay? You have the eight of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. You have uh, something telling me like you guys have a lot of skills, but it's like to pick one and move forward in it. 
okay like you could have been doing something for a long time one way but it's time to do something a different way uh, also give me like the magician vibes i'm not gonna lie um there could be a lot of opportunities that's coming towards you guys i feel like this could be like a financial uh people want to collaborate uh business increasing new job offers or whatever it is there's going to be a lot of things that's going to open up some doors for you that's coming your way but this three of wands it's, it's about you moving towards it but i do feel like you need to because it's going to be a lot coming towards you <laughs> libra you need to make sure that you have the time and the the or the find the balance to actually take care of yourself as well know when to step back and tend to yourself because you cannot pour from an empty cup here I feel like some of you guys might be going really, really hard, working really, really hard towards something, but also don't forget yourself in the mix. Like I said, make sure that you're taking care of yourself uh, physically to, to help with the spiritually as well, to also be grounded, spending time outside in nature uh, so you don't get wrapped up into the fame and fortunes of things uh, and lose sight of yourself. All right. That's a very important message the spirit just wanted to pour out to you. It's like something that's about to happen. Um, really good, really good things are about to happen, but they don't want you to lose sight of lose sight of yourself or what it is that you want to do goal wise. Okay, tell me more about the I need space for Libra. So we have the Page of Swords with the Star card and the Six of Pentacles. Okay, so a lot of you guys could just be taking time to pour into yourself and give to yourself. Like I said, you can't pour from, from an empty cup. So a lot of you guys could be right now just trying to rest up and get your energy together. Some of you guys are probably like in hermit mode. I feel like you could be feeling like you need time to yourself. You guys are studying. I don't know if it's studying yourself or just like, I feel like you guys are in a mode of learning right now. That could also be the hair infant. Like you guys are, uh, you're getting a lot of knowledge and you're gaining a lot of insight. Uh, it's like you're searching for something. You're searching for something and trying to gain that. Uh, ooh, yeah. Mm. Okay, something, <laughs> look, Spirit just said, when I bless you with what you ask for, make sure you can handle it. Okay, so some of you guys, hmm, okay, yeah, make sure you can handle it. All right, somebody could be also taking a break from school, okay, to get some kind of finances together or something, they're working on something, somebody could be working on a program, But I definitely see you guys taking some time off to like, uh, I'm not going to say a revamp, but just taking some time off to, to pour into yourself and to nurture yourself right now. You could be laying idle. Okay. Tell me about time to go separate ways. Something is about to end. We got the tower popping out here. Something is about to end here. This could be some kind of relationship. Okay, we do have the five of pentacles here. So, whoop, whoop, whoop. I hope you guys have been saving your money and taking heed to all the messages that has been coming in for Libra that has to do with finances. I know I haven't. I feel like I'm about to reap the the repercussions for not following my own messages myself uh that's been telling libra to like save money okay put money away because we do have this tarot card with the five of pentacles and the devil card somebody could be leaving a toxic work environment or a work environment that wasn't benefiting them energetically uh some of you guys could be going through a breakup as well and going through a point of feeling lonely because it's just like you might have a strong connection with this person this is somebody that you just find yourself keep going back to but it's just like it's time for you guys to call the quits and let it be that might be why spirit was like this your final warning okay like you keep asking for stuff but you keep going back to stuff okay i also feel like somebody's bad relationship with money is coming to an end as well somebody's bad relationship with money like you could really be working on 
your financial structure and your bad habits that you have. So tell me more about Crossroads for Libra. All right, somebody is basically moving on, okay? Somebody is getting ready to move on. I don't feel like you're no longer at a crossroads. You guys have been looking for something different. Something's about to come in and just move you out of a position that you're supposed to be in. There's a transformation coming in. You have look, a contract that you're going to be signing, okay? This is going to be something legal. Legal that's going to be moving you forward. I don't know if you're signing a deal with somebody or if... Um, Mm. Yeah, like a new job. I feel like this could be a new job offering here for you, Libra. Uh, something else just uh, spoke to me here with this crossword, crosswords, with this crossroads, this six of swords, this two of wands, and this justice card. This uh, karmic relation is come is is times up. This toxic relationship right here is times up. Okay, the time is up. It's time to go. Uh, it's time to move. Like it's time to move before the door closes. Okay, before you stuck. Okay. Mm time to get out basically tell me more about your controlling There's somebody out here who's trying to control a relationship. Uh, I feel like this is a new person that's coming in, or you're just really trying to be in control of your happiness because you don't want something to fucking flake. We got the Empress here. Something tells me like a mother figure could be trying to control your happiness, or it's like some kind of parental issue, some kind of childhood issues that you have with parents. That you let take a big toll on your relationships and your happiness and stuff like that. It's something about you feeling like you need to control everything. Uh, control the way things are going so that, I don't know, it's just like you don't want to be, like you need to know every move. Like you're kind of scared um, to let anybody come in and be in the lead or, you know, take control of anything. You don't know how to get out of your masculine. I'm not saying this is for all Libras, but this is for some. It's just like nobody has showed you or you feel like put you in a position to allow you to um, to let your guards down. I also feel like some wish fulfillment is coming in here. So it's some new money that's going to be popping in. And it's going to be something that you do on your own. This could be a side gig, something that allows you to be very, very creative here. Okay. Yeah, but you just got to get over the fear of um, of some kind of comfortableness. You just got to get over the fear of allowing something else to control, allowing spirits to have control or not trying to control everything. I feel like this is uh, career-wise and this is also love-wise for you guys, all right? So that's what I have today for my Libras. Hope you enjoyed. Until next time.